Hello, hello. Sneak peek into my next project with my little WL Toys V262. Uh, I flew it um, this morning uh, without the uh, plastic canopy and after I put uh, new bearings in and it was pretty smooth. Uh, it was a lot more quieter and I liked it. Um, so my next step is I went back to the original foam canopy. I heard some people talking about it online that they're, they're cutting it down and it works. It's actually pretty light. So I cut down the original large one. Uh, I left these two things on purpose because first of all I moved the the uh, warning, the, the low battery warning to the back. I had a little extended cable all around so I can jack it in and out from the battery anytime I want to. Uh, the sides I might use it for the next project which is the FPV. So one is going to hold the transmitter, uh, the other one's going to probably hold the antenna. And then up here I will place the uh, FPV camera. So yes, there's a purpose for this thing looking like a little pig with wings. <laughs> so right up here, instead of mounting the camera in the bottom, I'm going to mount the FPV camera up here. Um, facing outwards, maybe a little angle down, I'm not too sure yet. I don't care if the blades are in the way, there's more just to see where I'm going. Uh, down there is where I'm taping, so I'll see how I do it. And again, I'm going to use the uh, the bottom sections for holding the 5.8 uh, transmitter. And then the, um, yeah, I think it, I think some share the battery, some have to have an extra battery, so depending on the weight, I'll use, I'll use those two sections. So it's still very, very light. Uh, um, compared to the plastic canopy, especially since I cut down everything. Um, since I, and then I use the original brackets that are in the bottom to hold it back in place so it's very steady. And yes, I put some bling down here. I've been doing some more um, night flying lately and then these things are incredible at night. Um, once these, uh, the blades, once the um, the uh, LEDs kick in with the, um, the night saber mod they uh, these things reflect pretty good uh, and you can see the circles uh, on, on both sections so on that I just put a full reflector on the back on the front I actually have very small reflectors because I want to see the red and then these little dots you see there are actually uh, glow dots um, they eventually pick up the uh, absorb the light from the, um, the LEDs and cause it to give it um, kind of a, a cheap night blade feel you know, until we actually put in the real LEDs for the for the night flying. But like I said, I've been doing more and more night flying. It's been fun. The the wind is very very calm at night. Uh, this thing lights up like a Christmas tree already. And now with these little reflectors, um, it's pretty good. I haven't flown it in the daytime yet. Very high with the reflectors. I can imagine how this back part will look in the sun up there. <laughs> it's probably gonna shine very, very good up there, like a nice metallic feel. That's why I left the red as is, so I can see the red in, in the daytime. Um, but yeah, I am kind of anxious to see what this will do um, in the air. Now, this is very, very, super incredibly thin tape. So it's not gonna make any effect to the wind or it's not gonna lift or it's not gonna have any issues on the blade. This is like very, very extremely thin and it sticks very, very well. Once it's on there, it's hard to come off. I put a small piece as a test and when I tried to take it off, it was like really tough. So it really sticks on there. So depending on how these things work and how they look good and stuff, I might put them in the bottom of my heli uh, on, on one of my fixed pitches. So when I'm flying it high, um, get some nice reflection on there. Uh, and I can see where the front uh, compared to the back is. So we'll see. I'll let you guys know. I'm gonna. I'll pop him up tomorrow morning. Get him a little cruise. Uh, see how he likes the little piggy um, looking thing. And I mean, overall, it's not too bad. It's a different look. It looks a little, a little, a little tougher than the than the shell that I had. Um, it's still very, very light, and now I have extra areas to like kind of stick stuff around and not have the big bulk. So. Let's see, I might dress it up, I might put something around it, I might just leave it as is, or they actually sell this um, this film uh, as a carbon graphite film, it's as thin as this uh, of that tape, so I might just co cover it completely with the carbon graphite, and just to give it a nice carbon graphite feel and look to it, so, alright, I'll keep you guys posted, and I'm, I'm ho I hope you enjoy my videos.